Is Andy Reid a better coach today than he was in Philadelphia, you think? With a relationship with Patrick Mahomes. Now look, back then I covered the Eagles from 30,000 feet. It just didn't seem to me that his relationship with Donovan was the same relationship that I'm seeing in Kansas City. Is he a better coach today? As great as, as, great as Donovan McNabb was, as great of a Philadelphia quarterback that Donovan McNabb was, I don't know that Andy was ever in a position because you got to understand he came from Mike Holmgren. Mike Holmgren tried to manage every single thing about Brett Favre, but he couldn't because Brett was just a free wheeler and Brett made things happen, okay? I think Andy came into Philadelphia with the mindset that my quarterback and I, we're going to be linked, but I'm going to control a lot more of what, what he does on the football field. When you look at Patrick Mahomes, I mean, I don't know if you read the quote. Um, Travis Kelsey comes to Patrick Mahomes before that, that touchdown that ends the game. He says, listen, I know where a spot on the field is going to be open. I'm not going to run the route that's called. I'm going to run, run a, a, a out and up. And, and I guarantee you, Andy Reid has no problem with things like that because you know what? Even if they don't complete that pass, they're still going to com- convert the first down on the next play and keep the, dri- keep the drive alive. But he trusts those guys. He trusts Patrick Mahomes to make plays and do things in a way that maybe he didn't necessarily trust Donovan McNabb to do. And let's just be honest about it, too. Donovan McNabb never had the kind of weapons that Patrick Mahomes had.